this is Spidey1958, and welcome to my Let's Play that Feed the Beast Direwolf 20 Mod Pack, Episode 6. Which should have been Episode 7, but Episode 6 didn't record. Uh, it was related to the space and the lag I felt so time. So I have a whole lot to show you that I did on off screen, so we can get stuff, get you caught up. So first thing here is I added a uh, second fermenting barrel and a second power generator. So now producing 200 a tick. I basically put a filter in here. The reason the canola seeds weren't going back here is because the canola filled it up because this filled up. So I put a second filter here. With, uh, one here filters just sending the seeds just feeds the seeds back into the machine so and I'm still producing canola faster than this press can handle it so we will talk about that so then I built a uh, basic capacitor banks from e Ender IO which is pretty simple to build. Basically some diodes with just bronze, gold, and that. And uh, a redstone block, some iron. And that's fully stored up. And then if you use a wrench to click on it, if you shift click, whoops, Now I probably lost all my power. Do, 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 do. So if you click on it with a wrench, you can switch the mode that it shows. And I like this mode because it shows me the IO in and out. So, so apparently it didn't lose its power. Good. And to show you how I built that, was a lot of steps so I'm going to show you what I had to do. Uh, First thing I did was build some power cells which I put up here in the works. These are from extra utilities. These generate during the sun one power each of grid power. So I built three sets of these. Their recipe, oops, escape. That's not what I wanted. Their recipe is basically some lapis, one of those resonating redstone crystals, and some polished stone. The way you get polished stone is you just take four stone bricks in a row and that makes polished stone. And then these you can either make by using ender shards, which you get from using a glass cutter on an ender, or you find them occasionally. I didn't have any ender pearls. I had found just enough to make. So I made three sets of these. So the next step after I did that is I made this thing, the resonator. This does two different things. It will take polished stone like this. Whoops. And if you put it in it, it will basically turn it into the uh, stone burnt blocks like so okay and then if you put a you also need this to make upgrades because you need to put a weighted gold plate in here to get the basic upgrade template which I'll show you what I use one for in a little bit so after that I made my stone bricks and I made four of the these things, which it's saying solar panels when they're not solar panels. Why are you calling them solar panels? They're not solar panels. Anyway, might as well do it this way. Ah. So 
So then I made the lava mills, which are those br bricks, one of the resonating crystals in gold, made four of those. They generate two power if they're adjacent to a lava. It doesn't matter how many lava they're adjacent to, they produce two. So I made a little pot here. This produces eight. So that gives me power 24 seven because those solar doesn't and then I built this wireless transmitter which uh, its recipe is basically mortal stone bricks one of the resonating and two blocks of redstone and then I built this little thing here looks like I produced just enough power at night so I'm probably gonna have to add more soon so but next time we'll add water mills so I built four of those because you get four of those they're basically wireless RF so to build those is basically one stone brick and one resonating red crystal and that gives you four and I should get inside before zombies come and kill me Okay, so the next thing I need to do is build a trap, a uh, something for my farm here. Uh, I need a trap door. There we go. Trap door. And we're going to throw you in there for the moment. My inventory is really, really getting messy. Okay. So then you saw me build the farm blocks and I was building that when a creeper exploded and destroyed part of my... So I need a farm hatch, which means I need another one of these. Which means I need more copper. Grab some glass. Well, I need glass, but oh no! Let's bring you. You're in there. Okay. And then I need more wood. Okay, now I should build, be able to build my farm block. Then I need to build a farm hatch, which I need another gear. There's a base gear. Tin gear. Farm hatch. Okay, and then I need to build, let's get a bunch more wood here. I need three chests, one, two, three. And I need two more wood, which I have just enough. Build three of these. And then I need one wood, one apple, and a bunch of saplings. Okay. And let's sleep and make a day. out the wrong door. I know it's going to be bigger than this, but this is the ba beginning of my farm. So basically, I built a transfer node here with a upgrade mining. 
but be waterproof here. And this, I just can't pick the right things not to click on stuff with. So I can't open that because I need to put down the gearbox to replace the one that exploded or got exploded. There's a big cave system under there and unfortunately it's full of nasty stuff and I set off a creeper immediately below my farm, which was not a good idea. Okay, now I should be fine. Okay, so let's go ahead and put most of the saplings in here. So now we got the basics of what we need. I gotta figure out exactly how because I don't want to block that is my problem. But I want to get power into there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm trying to figure out how best to do this. Let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and build some power cable. Well, can't you use universal conduit to run power? I think you can. Let's go ahead. This is probably going to be a mistake. Okay, let's put a torch down here, light this area up. Okay. We'll have to make a way to get down here. I think I'll put over here. Oh, let's eat something. Okay. Get our pipes here. Mean to put that one there. I just right click with the wrench. Nope. I gotta go down and get it. to figure out a way down there but this will do for the moment
Okay. Yep, I think that's the way I'm going to do it. Okay. So let's go ahead and put... We're going to need one more of these ultimately, but we'll take care of that in a little bit. Okay. And what did I do with the furnace? Okay. Didn't I just pick up... Is it sitting down there? I lost the furnace somehow, huh? Well, that's amazingly confident of me. How the heck did I lose a furnace? When it shouldn't have gone into either of my bags, should it? Not in that bag. Not in that bag. Somehow I lost my furnace. Or in that. I have no idea how I did that. So let's go ahead and make another furnace. So we're going to need a clay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I need to put these bags away when I'm not. Oh, it didn't go in the bag this time. Okay. That's clever of it. Throw you guys in there. Cook you up fast. I should have another machine. Yes, I have another machine block, so that shouldn't be difficult. Okay, then why we're doing that? I need to build a filter. There's a different type of filter for controlling what gets stuff. Where the heck are you? There you are. Transfer filter. I need one of you. Okay. Okay. And we're going to configure you. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I still have to build a filter, Lal, to put in you. I need another filter. Okay. Now I can configure you to only take wood. And my bricks should be done. And that was a furnace. No, nope, not a furnace generator, a furnace. Okay. Just going to 
put the furnace down right here. And we're going to put our little filter friend right here. Whoops, not there. I am not having a lot of luck here. Okay, let's see if we can do this, breaking this here and this. Okay, get out our wrench. Break you there, and okay, that's what we want. We want, well, we could put it here, and no, we want it. Actually, let's put it here in the bottom. Now let's not put it here in the bottom. Let's go ahead and put it here on the side. And then our pipe goes here. And can I get that on there? No. So we do want to go in the bottom. So that we can do this. And break that one pipe there, put our filter there, that's not where I want it, why won't you put it where I want it, can I just put you there first, oh I can do that, maybe that would have been easier the whole, the whole time. Okay, now I should be able to click there, put my filter there, and put that there. Okay, and grab my stuff on the floor, put my cobble here. And we're probably going to have to go around this way. Okay. Then we're going to have to put one here on top of this. Oh, we need to set that to extract mode, don't, don't we? I swear. Okay. Oh no, we don't have to set anything. I'm getting confused between my mods now. Where are my torches? Okay. And we should be able to run this over here. And in theory, all we need to do is kick in some charcoal and we should be starting to go. So let's go sleep again. Okay. So let's grab a stack of charcoal. It's done. So I need one more of you. Need more than that. So 
more than I need, but that should do for the moment. Okay. Okay, now I need wood. Just one piece. Okay, but I need to make a key to lock that, so what do we need to make the storage? The drawer key, we need one of those. Okay, so we need a bunch more wood. Need one of these. And one of these. And then we need two of these. And I need a couple pieces of gold. Let's make that first. And then we need one of those. Dun, 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 dun. Let's lock those. Then I want to make a second one of those. So I can make one of these. Oh, we don't have that upgrade yet. So I guess I don't need it. So I made a second one for no reason, but that's okay. All right, then I need a bunch of smooth stone. Bricks here. Sleep and make a day. Oh, it is day. Do -do -do -do. Let's get out our shovel. Okay, let's get our shovel of excavating. Oh, maybe that already is the max size. I thought it was bigger than that low. But maybe it's not on this. Whoops.
noise. Is there something else I have to... realize there's something else I have to acquire that I'm going to acquire out of this farm. I guess I could just look online and see how big it is. That's like cheating. Well, we're at that wrapping up point. We got the basic farm up and going. I'm going to go ahead and try to make it look pretty and expand it out to its max size and that. So as always, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and give me a like or a comment. And if you dislike the episode, leaving me a dislike fine, but please leave a comment saying why you dislike the episode. As always, this is Spidey1958, and have fun Minecrafting.